Hello fellow collectors and welcome back. Gallic Gun Toys back at it with another Dragon Ball review for you today. And today we are looking at the Bandai Dragon Dragon Star Dragon Ball Super Figures. Now this is series 4 and this is the rest of the half of the wave that you need to complete Merge Zamasu here. Okay, now let's get the first figure in this review on the stand. And we'll have a look at him. <clears throat> okay, so, Vegeta starting off. Very nice figure. The paint is really nice. Love the paint and the hair. The gold is just really spot on. This Wii symbol looks really nice. Very good. Articulation in his head isn't great. You can spin right around, but can't really raise it, as you can see. He's got full articulation. In the arms, legs, articulation's pretty good. It is hindered a little bit by the crutch piece, but overall you can get him into some alright poses. But if you guys are like me and you collect the SH figure arts as well, you're probably just gonna have him in a vanilla pose. Okay, so here he is for comparison with the Goku from series three. Okay. Okay, and Vegeta also comes with two grappling hands. Now, I've noticed the s most uh, Dragon Star figures come with the two grappling hands and the two fists. Uh, but Zamasu here actually comes with a karate chopping fist uh, hand, which is really good because that's his sort of go to from the comics. Now, He's got a little bit of articulation of the head, so you can sort of move it that far, so it's not great. Uh, articulation is alright in the arms, but it is hindered by the sculpt in his Kai outfit. Same thing with the legs, the skirt hinders the movement, so though the articulation is there, it's not of much use. So, again, really good for a vanilla pose. And here he is, standing next to Trunks, from Series 3 for comparison. Okay, now Zamasu also comes with two fists and the two uh, grappling hands. Okay, now on to Goku Black. Alright, now Goku Black, same thing again. Two fists, two grappling hands. And like Zamasu, he comes with the energy blade. Now that is just, you just pop one of the hands off and just replace that with the energy blade, like with Zamasu there. So it's quite simple and quite effective. I'm actually, actually quite a fan of it. At first, when I got Vegito, I wasn't, wasn't too fond of it, but now I'm a little bit more sold on it. Now let's have a look at the builder figure. So you need, in Series 4, you will get the legs and the mutant arm. And in Series 3, you get the head, the chest piece, the crotch piece, and this arm. Alright, so, fantastic figure. Uh, now, you're not going to be able to get him into some super dynamic poses because of the weight of the arm. He does tend to tip. But if you've got him sort of vanilla posed... He looks alright like that. And just a personal note, I think he looks like Mad Morty from Season 3. And he has the big mutant sentient arm, or sentient arm Morty. Is that what you'd call it? I don't know. But there is Merge Zamasu. I highly recommend picking the six figures up just to complete him. Because he looks fantastic. I love the colour. I love the fact that they went with the half mutant, like the half green, half purple. That looks fantastic. Now I'll bring in the Gido from Series 5, so you can get a bit of a comparison. And here he is next to Jiren. For a little bit more of a comparison. There we go. Okay. So, I will just quickly bring in everyone we need to complete this guy. So, Goku Black, Vegeta, 
Anzamasu. That's series four. And then series three is Goku. Hit. And Trunks. Future Trunks from Dragon Ball Super. Okay, so definitely worth picking up. A uh, personal note from my batch is I think this is probably the best quality batch I've got. I also, I so far only have uh, series 3, 4 and 5, but the quality control issues and just general, general issues and gripes, though I might have, may have liked some of the characters more, I think this is definitely my favourite in terms of quality, because Zamasu, Goku Black, and Vegeta are all probably some of the most solid figures of the ones I currently have, though Jiren is one of my favourites of all of them so far, just because he's a badass, come on, he's Jiren, how can, how can you not, how can you not love Jiren? Okay guys, well thank you very much for joining me on this Dragon Ball Super Bandai Dragon Stars review. Join me in the next one. Please subscribe to make sure you catch the next video. And if you enjoyed the content, please leave a like, drop a comment if you're so inclined. And that has been my review of the Dragon Star figures. Thank you for joining me, and I'll catch you in the next video, guys. Bye for now.